like you just like where it was a clean sound tape. Yeah, yeah. Impressive. Hilarious what I have to say to him. I actually have another question to ask you about uh, in terms of the three question thing. Okay. Uh, things a little like clear to me. Uh, who's Andrew? And why is he part of this process? Andrew Shaver is the artistic director of Sidemark, and uh, he, starting from our first show, became, at the time, he was sort of uh, a, a de facto director. Uh, our first show was American Buffalo, and, uh, and and he just sort of said, oh, yeah, I'll do it, and it didn't seem like it was like, I'll be the director uh, forever. It was just, it seemed, it seemed uh, appropriate and uh, unique to that project, but then it just became uh, quite organically that he, uh, he I, I don't, I, I don't know, the, I don't remember the, how it unfolded, he just sort of, uh, I think he, he was, he had the, um, he had an experience, um, Drew had a company before that, that uh, a couple of us worked with, but he, he he sort of knew the ins and outs of what it took to be a company and and what it um, what it felt like to be a company and and, and run a company and, and make things work. And so uh, I think uh, why is an entry involved? I, I think that was honestly just. Uh, um, Logistical. He he's been working at, at, at Stratford um, uh, and uh, runs a concert series in Stratford. And um, quite frankly, he's the busiest uh, in terms of working out of all of us. And when it came time to do this show, um, I, I assumed he was going to be busy. And there's also uh, kind of. We would have you. Uh, uh, let's see. Let me, let me start again. Uh, I'll start again. Uh, when we first made Trying for the Kingdom, uh, it, it, it was because uh, Graham and uh, Andrew were both involved in something else, and I was going uh, crazy and very uh, frustrated and weighed down by. Uh, and, and, I couldn't stand the idea of being in a Montreal winter again without uh, making something creative that meant something to me. And so I asked uh, Gemma, James Smith, who um, isn't involved in this one, but uh, has worked with Sidemart a lot, and Kyle, who is still involved in it, uh, and uh, a couple of other uh, folks that, that uh, uh, work with us. Uh, to, to make something in the dead of winter uh, for no money and so it, it, at the time it was just that they were busy and, and so when it came around this time uh, the, between the two of them Graham and Drew who were not involved last time um, uh, uh, Graham had, ne had never directed for us before and I think felt a kinship with it and, and, uh, and approached me and said that he was interested in doing it and, and when he became the director of the piece this time and, and uh, we had Sarah Yaffe and Kyle and me already and we figured out what we were going to do without Gemma, uh, there wasn't really anything to do and I think, I don't know, I think maybe he was, uh, he ended up doing this music show with Justin Rutledge. Uh, which I think turned out very well. Um, uh, it, he's he's definitely uh, Drew has become the, the the most visible part of our company, and, and uh, which is great because he, he, he is a, he's a great spokesperson and, and a great uh, person to have it at, uh, as our artistic director. But I feel like this one was was made uh, uh, sort of by accident or or, or just. Just logistically, without him, and, and uh, it's a, it's a nice little place for the rest of us to sort of stretch out and and, um, and for Graham to exercise his director muscle, which I think he never has, and, and will only benefit us in the, in the long run. And and uh, 
it's uh, yeah, he, he, he it certainly wasn't a, a personal thing, but it was definitely an exercise. I think a helpful exercise in, in our company for us to sort of step up, like uh, for me to do something other than uh, just act uh, to to be in a producer role and. and uh, um, and for Graham to have a, a chance at directing and for us to have just like a little more uh, uh, sort of exercise our, our, our making theater muscles as opposed to acting. Um, yeah, I guess uh, that's a long answer. I'm sorry. <laughs>